Gazzy, congratulations. The scoreline said 3 0. However, tough battle there against Christoph Rotarski. How would you sum it up? Yeah, I think it was a tough battle against myself. You know, I was um, trying to work out the pace of the game and trying to hit doubles, trying to score in between. So, yeah, all elements were against me. And, you know, yeah, he missed a couple of doubles towards the end, but I missed a lot all the way through. And thankfully, I come over the winning line, just park this one out, put it behind me, and, yeah, practice a bit more and hopefully play a bit better in the next round. We saw you beating yourself up that on the stage there a little bit, trying to G yourself up. There were a few tactics involved. Well, maybe from him, I'm not sure, but it was it was quite a, a slow game, and yeah, I mean, if I can hit my doubles to start and deal with the pace of the game a little bit better, then I'll be all right. But uh, yeah, I wasn't dealing with it very good today. Martin Schindler up next, looking forward to playing him on neutral territory, other than the Euro Tour. Is England neutral territory? <laughs> I'm not sure, but no, I'm. I just concentrate on my own game. I know how well Martin can play. I know how well I can play, and. If we both bring our A games, then it's going to be a fantastic game for everyone. But fingers crossed, I can play a little bit or a lot better than what I did today and get through that game. But yeah, hopefully the English are behind me this time and the German are not here to support him. You seem in a relaxed frame of mind at the moment. Are you enjoying playing right now? Yeah, no. I mean, games like that, no. Other games when there's um, a bit of flow and a bit of continuity towards the game, then yeah, you're sort of enjoying it. But you know, I, I, we've moved into the property now, which eases a little bit of stress and a bit of anger sometimes because things are not happening. But yes, um, over the next couple of months, I promise I'll get a lot better and I'll be a bit more consistent. But at the minute, my game's not where I wanted to be, but I'm still winning games. First round's done and dusted. Had a chance to have a look at everyone. Who do you, um, who do you say is your biggest threat here to winning this title? Anyone. I mean, it doesn't matter. You've seen Chizzy's been playing fantastic all this year. First round, gone out, and probably people were saying he's one of the favourites to win this. I think you, you can't look any further than Michael Van uh, I mean, I mean, he's he's always on his game, no matter what. So, uh, apart from if I think I'm going to win myself, apart from myself, I think uh, you don't look much further than him. Gezi, congratulations. Thank you very much. Gezi, again, in the crucial moments tonight, you were there to punish him in all three sets in, in deciding legs. Yeah, well... Uh, he missed an opportunity in the in the last set and the second set, but yeah, I just one of those games where you're just clinging on, clinging on, and hanging on, trying to win win legs and wing sets. But you know, I'm glad I came through that one. There's many of those games I've lost, and yeah, even though if I'd have played really well and lost, I'd have been gutted. But I don't mind playing rubbish and winning. The pedestrian pace of the game that you've alluded to. Do you think that was a, a deliberate thing tonight? I'm not sure. I know probably not. I don't think Christoph's that sort of player, but. It's hard to deal with those sort of players, even whether they try or not. But I, no, I don't think Christoph would have tried that. But it was difficult to deal with. But it's just his game, and yeah, like I said, I don't think he done it on purpose. You've made the semi-finals at least the last three years here. How confident are you of, of making that far? Yeah, if I, if I get off and score a little bit better in between, then yeah, I'm confident because you know if you, if you can't get off and you're giving people you know two or three pitches lead then it's a tough game but yeah if i can get if i can get off whether it's first second or third dart then yeah i'm uh, in with a chance cheers guys thank you jay mentioned it there you've you've had some good success in this tournament before is it a tournament that you really enjoy in the beginning of my career no but now <laughs> i seem to think uh, the longer the tournament goes on yeah, and it favors yeah the better player sort of so to speak and you have more opportunities to step up Apart from the first round, even in that game, I, I could have slipped up one or two sets and still been in. But yes, um, one of the tournaments I didn't like, but I'm getting used to it a little bit more. Did you have the chance to play in Dublin before it came to yeah, Leicester? I can't remember. Lost there you... a couple of times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I actually lost the first round most of the time. I, I lost to Chizzy the last time I ever played there, I think. And then, yeah, since it came to Leicester, I've done all right. So. Hopefully it stays you. Keeping it here in Leicester then. And when it's Boyle Sports as well, I always do well in the <laughs> event. So. Cheers, Coventry. Was the one in Coventry? Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, guys. Sorry. Gary, well done on the win, getting through to the next round. Uh, you won 3 0, but every set went went all the distance. Did you feel always in control despite every set going 2 2? I felt control in the first set. I never thought I was going to lose that one, but the other two sets, it could have went anyway. I was um, sometimes hoping he would miss. Especially to get off. I mean, you shouldn't shouldn't be like that. Oh, you should try and get the game un under your control. But yeah, it was um, the last two sets could have won anyway. We spoke on Monday how everyone is the, the the most important thing for them is just getting through that first round because it's such a ruthless format. Is there almost less tension now that the format begins to get longer? 
hundred percent. Even in that game, you know, I actually thought the first round was first to three. So when I see the first game come up, I was like, oh, I played this tournament enough times to realize that it's only first to two. But yeah, that was, I think it's uh, best of seven, is it? Still, still yeah, same, same form. Quarterfinals, same again. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I learned something new again. <laughs> You'd have to get through to the next round then. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was going up another set, but there you go. <laughs> you mentioned how people can't see past Michael as the favourite for this tournament. Where do you assess your game at the moment compared to his? Apart from this tournament, double start, double out, then yeah, my, my game's in a good place, but this is a unique tournament with a unique format, and you know, it throws up loads of. Unex unexpected results so yeah don't worry about how well you're playing or how good you are you can lose in this tournament doesn't matter if it's first round second round third round but you know sometimes the cream rises to the top but you need to be at the best of your game so yeah it's um, a unique tournament and it's tough one to play in. Gary thank you very much Rada.